What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We about to get into tea room. Uh, Lena's mom exposes Nick and her mom. Corey hurt after Prime and Michi both cranked Carmen. I don't know. Previously, I spoke on Corey calling out Michi and Prime. Him or his little boyfriend, cousin. Mm -mm. Them little cute get boys. Ain't no Corey standing on that in real life. And we can do it right now in real life. So then Michi's cousin Prime did come back with a response. We ain't on that. Like, I ain't on no internet shit. And I ain't going back and forth for no nigga talking internet shit that's sitting next to a well known homosexual. You know what I'm saying? That's and that's nothing against like nothing against him either. Niggas had your niggas was cranking your wife and bro already crushed. We cranked her. So we can all pretty much say what that mean? <laughs> like normally I know the verbiage. That's a lie. Not with them. They, they it's something new every day. But what I do know is crush definitely means smash. I don't know what crank is though. Say that Carmen and Corey are back together, although Carmen hasn't been speaking about it. I mean, she's been around for the past month or so. Now I did ask Corey when he was on live if he heard what Michi's cousin Prime stated. This was his response. T Roy said Did you see where Prime said? T Roy, what's up, T Roy? What's all I got going on, T Roy? <laughs> see t room understand i mean not t room Corey actually well he finally understands because he didn't either y'all niggas need us you get what i'm saying if we wasn't talking about y'all nobody would know now don't get me wrong you're gonna get your views but see when diversity comes or not diversity but a problem that needs to be addressed. Y'all need help with us addressing it. We all a team. And until y'all really realize it. Y'all just going to be mad. But a lot of them are catching on. Niggas starting to get their own setups. And everybody reacting to shit. Speaking of setups. I got my whole setup on my ebook. In my uh, description. Literally everything that I use. From cameras to microphones to the PCs. I got it. So y'all make sure y'all tap into that ebook. But yeah, you know. Anyway. In that shit, T Ro. T Ro. Y'all know how Corey is at G7, man. We chilling on that. You know, we gonna let them boys alone. But they like them all. Much love and success. You know what I'm saying? So now let's hop back on this topic right, with right. Neek, King, and Lena. Now you guys know Lena and Neek went back and forth for a little bit because Lena apparently came for Neek's parenting. Now Lena did go on to Instagram and she posted ah, a good ass mom. Now if you guys didn't watch my last video, I spoke on King and Lena's engagement party and King's family apparently not being there. People in the comments were asking where is Splain's family so in Neek's video her mom was actually talking to King's mom now Neek's mom also had a message for Lena y'all uh his mama and this is alleged but uh allegedly his mama don't like Lena unfortunately so I am tired of her trying to degrade my daughter as a mother because Neek takes good care of guys and Neek pay for children she pay Neek take care of me Nick is here every week, at least two or three days out of the week, taking her son to school. He is in a, one of the best schools in Baton Rouge. And it's okay for her mom to take care of Kaiser. No cap. Just like King need help, so do Nick. So that's okay. Um, right now. And Thank God her mama can do it. Everybody knows why he's going to school here. Who better to help take care of your child than your mother? Somebody who loves that child just like you. So, Lena, you stop degrading my baby as a mother because you don't have help. So then Lena's stepmom, Lisa, pops. Lord, Lisa. Every one of these people who don't personally know my family really needs to stop. My daughter moved away and started a beautiful family. Yes, it's it gets hard without help here. 
in there. But even if she lived closer, I wouldn't be raising her kids. Damn. Definitely being the best Grammy ever. But for people to assume I choose to stay away because my daughter's bad is dead wrong, irrelevant, and ignorant. I have faith that all this negativity will fade and try parenting will continue wealthy. I mean, healthy. So these kids don't suffer. If you support bullying and body shaming, you're pathetic. Let's pray for evil people who involve themselves off. She states every one of these. Oh, hell, I already read it to you, right? you guys leave the shaming part after that down in the comment section. Below Wait, her. She also mentioned the body shaming part lived close. Neek and her mom. I mean, she did state here. Even if she lived closer, Lena's kids would not be raised by her meaning they wouldn't be living with her. She also mentioned the body shaming part after Neek's mom called Lena chubby. Now you guys leave your opinions on that down in the comment section below, but let's move on to this next topic with Hallie and Chloe. I, go lie, I didn't hear her call her chubby. Now they recently started back up their tea time and while they were on live, baby Halo made an appearance. Looks like he's trying to be seen. Hey. Hey. Okay. Maybe we should pause. I don't want him to hear the inappropriateness. Yeah. What are y'all talking about? Now? Hey, baby. He's smiling. He's so you had a good nap. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So maybe that concludes the yeah. time. <laughs> what was y'all talking about? I done missed it. Hey, hey there's some hey, people saying Halo don't understand. Yes, he does. He's very smart. <laughs> hey. 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 Okay, don't, don't turn around. Don't turn around. Don't. Don't turn. Okay. I th Tea time sound like uh, they speaking about, like they talking about what's going on in the world, you know? Everybody doing that. Y'all better get it together. I think that concludes it, guys. Oh, wait. People saying they need to know. So they said, he is a baby. Finish this story. <laughs> okay, just finish Wait, it. wait. Oh. oh, I completely missed it. <laughs> Child, we done already seen him. Okay, just finish Wait, it. wait. Oh. Y'all, we already seen him. DDG done showed him. Did you see him? No. No, not really. <laughs> okay. Someone said, we know he a genius, baby, but come on. <laughs> I don't think she know Tea Room caught y'all lacking. <laughs> okay. Okay. He's a cutie. That's it. Where was it? What's it called? I forgot. Okay. He said he was black and gay, so let me search that. Wait, what? <laughs> we should have been. Let's it. wait. Let's Maybe just wait. To somebody that made made it as a millionaire and a first generation college student all that nice stuff whatever you know all that good jazz right bro when you make money it's gonna devalue bro when you make a hundred thousand dollars a hundred thousand gonna go by so quick because you gonna want to upgrade your lifestyle Facts. that's what you got to understand like when you get money you don't want to live the same bro if you barely eating if you barely eating or you barely like making money or anything, right? Or or you barely doing nice things, you can't go out because you ain't got no money and all that. When you make a hundred bands, you're gonna wanna do that. You're not gonna wanna keep barely eating. Hell no, nah, he ain't never lied about that. And then the more money, more problems. Cause your people start to see you got money and then niggas like, I'm trying to tap in. How do I get money? It's it's a lot. So then when that happens I can only imagine that a hundred K a month. I'm on the way. You gonna upgrade your lifestyle, then that money gonna eat up even quicker. To me, not even even a flex or nothing, but a hundred thousand dollars, it's it's a good amount of money. It it'll make me get up. It'll make me jump for sure. But like, a band to me is like a hundred dollars. Swear to God, bro. Not even trying to flex. I'm just trying to let y'all know. A band used to be everything to me. So it's just like when you make more money, 
it's going to make the money that you it's going to make your lifestyle change to the point where you're going to devalue money even more. Now, a band to somebody with a billion dollars is literally a penny. There's levels to it. That's a fact. There's too many levels to it. It's like a million dollars. Why I go across the world for a million? I do whatever. Not do whatever. I ain't gonna say that. Don't, never mind. Don't click that. <laughs> I'm gonna say whatever, but I'm saying like I go across the world for an M. But a hundred bands, I wouldn't. Where is the damn remote at? Appreciate that swan, Addy. Hey, get that money, bro. Listen, it's the it's that time, man. It's time to uh turn your life up. But you know. Yeah, if y'all want to learn how to, I got ebooks in my description. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.